was laughing my ass off when I killed my mother. You're laughing? Why were you laughing? I don't know. What? This video from Texas is crazy. This is Brian Malera, whose truck was stolen just north of Houston, Texas on Tuesday morning. After two hours of looking for it, Brian and his dad were able to track down the truck. He took our truck and uh, well, we chased him down, you know, we called the cops, but you know, we didn't see them. So we had to take, you know, actions on our own. Brian filmed the high speed chase with his dad armed with a handgun in the passenger seat. The high speed chase went on for about 30 minutes before a shootout started with the driver. We were trying to get him to stop and we decided to shoot at the tires. After that, the thief eventually crashed near a police station. We saw the, the cops at that point who started honking, you know, trying to make it obvious for them to see. Next thing you know, I had like 10 cops right behind me, you know, pointing the gun at me and trying to shoot at me. The thief is now in jail and the truck was returned with two flat tires and a damaged windshield. It just messed up how people just, you know, they don't know how much, you know, things cost and they just, you know, they just take sh Fortunately, no one was injured in the chase or the encounter with the police, but police are urging people to call 911 instead of taking the law into your own hands. I killed my mom and her shit. Why'd you change? Why'd you get rid of that shirt? It had pieces of my mother's brain stuck to it while I was laughing my ass off when I killed my mom. Something went on at your house today, and I just kind of like you to kind of tell us what happened. I killed my mom and her snake on the stomach. Is there a reason why you did that? Yes, sir. Did you set the house on fire, too? I tried to. I don't know. I actually got the whole house on fire now. How many times did you hit her with the sledgehammer? I'd say at least 12. 12 times then. Where, where did you hit her at? On her body? Around the head area. I put my fingers on her neck to check her pulse to make sure she was dead. What, what did you think about doing this? I mean, when did this pop into your head as far as killing your mom? Seven years ago. Was she a pretty good mom or? She wasn't very good. Good mom. She wasn't very good. I had no good mom. Hey, I'm uh, I was trying to put it into my backpack and then the fire alarm started and I just ran out. What were you going to use that knife for? Were you looking to kill someone else tonight? I'm laughing at God in my life. Well, I mean, how do you feel when you, when you killed your mom? I didn't think Why did you hit her 12, about, about 12 times with them? Why so many times? To make sure she was dead. Is that blood on your pants right there? And is that your mother's blood? Yes, sir. Are those the same shoes you were wearing? Yes, sir. Are those are the same pants you were wearing? Yes, sir. Are those the same shirt you were wearing? No, sir. Where, where's the shirt you were wearing? Oh, that's her other line. Why'd you change? Why'd you get rid of that shirt? It had pieces of my mother's brain stuck to us. We've been doing this a long time, and I mean, sledgehammer is a very unusual weapon to kill somebody with. Why a sledgehammer? I wonder if you just deny her that was worried that I missed the vital area. Did you love your mother? Somewhat. So you can rewind the clock and go back. What would you do? I would probably kill Josh with a sledgehammer, too. You ever laugh? Sometimes. <laughs> what, what makes you laugh? Various things, various things. Give me an example. Well, I was laughing my ass off when I killed my mother. You were laughing? Why were you laughing? I don't know. Why are you laughing your ass off when you killed your mother? I don't know. Yes, you do. We went over this a while ago. You know why that you wanted to kill your mom. You just don't want to tell me. No, I actually don't know why I was laughing. A lot of people said it's just how unusual for a 15-year-old to take a sledgehammer and be laughing his ass off and hit her in the head with it 12 times. What do you think? I don't have any information to give to him. Now, listen to him describe how he was describing some stuff, man, that was quite disturbing. Um, he showed no emotions or anything. Like, he was just stale, you know what I'm saying? And I'm up here thinking to myself, like, bro, 
How could you be that calm explaining what you did as we read at the end and said you just basically told them what you did like it's a normal casual thing? And that is, man, rest in peace to them, to his mom's soul, man. That's just messed up. Nobody deserves to be, um, mm. don't know what to say, man, but, um, yeah, he said if he could redo it again, he would have killed more people, another person, a guy. So, this lets you know this boy mentally wasn't all the way there, and he seriously should have been diagnosed to see psychologically what was going on.